Well, I've got here classic uh, type photo cell, one of the old uh, older styles. Um, it's a PBL two four zero six type, and I'm going to energize it. And the default action is uh, closed for like a minute or so. Um, there is a uh, resistor here. It's a bimetallic strip. Is this one? So the resistor will be heating the bimetallic strip. And as you can see, the contacts are closed. So the photo cell is in uh, in the test mode, so it should heat up the biometallic strip, switch the lights off. So the test lamp is here, this orange uh, neon. Oh, it's actually an LED lamp, so we'll just wait till that happens. I may shortcut that part of the video as it uh, event progresses. So photo cells are used for controlling street lights, individual street lights, and uh, they're used. Uh, all over the world like that. Some streetlights went on Ripple systems or Pilot systems. So hopefully we get some action shortly. Click, there you go. Take the light away. There we go, energized. Okay, I'll go a bit more in detail on the thing itself. Get pop a light on here now, and then we can see what we're gonna do. I'll just switch it off so it's safer for me to handle. So this is the bio round resistor. And here's the LDR. And the black dots are put on to make the cell more or less sensitive to light. So uh, yeah, make it darker than it's uh, for a certain look setting. That's the way they've done it on this particular device. So I can click it mechanically. This is an adjustable screw that pushes onto this uh, copper plate with the toggle contact. Very simple. situation so red comes onto the metal framing here. Resistor is in its bracket spot welded on here so the power goes through the uh, resistor heating the biometallic strip through the photo cell which will adjust the cadmium cell I think. Output from the photo cell goes uh, through another resistor 4.7k to the neutral which is black and then the white wire, here's the switching wire, so the electrons flow through here, back to the metal part. And then the contact will toggle, and the lights are switched on. So this is the I, I, you call it I daylight switch. It's made, I think, Iwasaki, made in uh, Japan, it's a proper Japanese one. And um, here's the label. 6 ampere rated, so the whole device sits in here. Wires come out, I hear a cricket here too. And I got this plastic font on here, a diffused font. And I'll put a screw in here, and then it's all together. There's a little venting hole because there's moisture. And I've taken the bracket off. There's normally an L-shaped bracket here, which you can attach it to onto a uh, post or joist on a building or a streetlight pole. So this is a little eye photo cell. A few different photo cells I got here. This is a PDL, with the same principle. This is uh, more expensive, and it has an adjustable option in here. So you can set it for the time it has to do the switching. On day day two four six eight and the lux setting you can adjust on this one so active in neutral and load very simple. PDL one often you find these on the side of distribution pillar boxes. Then I'm I'm, sh I'm sure I've shown these in videos before. The the good old Zodian. Um, this is an SS three. That's a seventy lux I think. 
70 lux, I've got the Cray food connector on here, and there's a SS6, 35 lux, so that um, is a bit more, switches in darker, so the lower lux is uh, darker, yeah, I think it is. So that's the Zodian ones, and then you have these little other photo cells which are around, and there's heaps more varieties that are these tiny things. That is um, Zodian, of course, SS12, miniature photo cell, and a little uh, thing, you just drill in the M18 or M20 hole, a couple of glands, stick it in the side of the street light head or in a pillar, and you can control remotely your uh, street light equipment. So, not much in it, it's very straightforward, these devices. I'll check this video on. I didn't have much time today. I've been mean, uh, was sick last night. I got a bit of food poisoning. Eat something wrong, so hence um, I need to cobble something together. So the main thing was that was the eye PBL two four zero six, and we gave a demo how it works. Um, any questions? Put it in the comments, and uh, I'll try to reply to you. Hope you enjoyed it, and. See what we can cobble together tomorrow. Uh, today we're in day 21. We're going for three weeks in lockdown at uh, midnight. The time at the moment is oh, it's about 12 minutes to eight.